Objective 7, explain how ions form both positive and negative. So ions are, what is an ion? What's the definition of an ion? Anyone? What's an ion? An atom? What's an ion? With the atom with the charge. It's an atom with the charge because the atom gained or lost electrons. Remember, way back in chapter four, we said. Atoms are usually neutral because the protons and electrons are equal to each other. But if you gain or lose electrons, you're going to pick up a charge. What charge do electrons have on them? They're negative. So if you gain more electrons, guess what kind of ion you form? A negative ion. So negative ions are atoms that gained electrons. What kind of atoms tend to gain electrons? Usually larger atoms, which is the metals. I'm sorry, you're right. It's usually the smaller atoms. Thank you. You caught me. Usually the smaller atoms, the nonmetals. You're right. And why do the nonmetals gain? Because they have the stronger nucleus and they're closer. And then the positive ions are just the opposite. So they are atoms that lost electrons. And I know that's weird because it's the opposite of how you do it in math. Losing is always negative. But so this is usually your larger atoms. It's going to be the metals with weaker nucleus and further for the valence electrons.